Hey guys, and welcome back. Yeah, so now we're back to the Nexus. Right, and they've got shite loads of slime missions still in here. And a load of people to meet. Hey, Vedra. Don't. Don't shove the crate off the. You shove the crate off the ramp. Where do they find these people? <laughs> No, good job. Keeping tabs on things back here? Yeah, I try to watch what's going on while we're away, but it's nice to check in person. Shore leave is for relaxation. Take some time off. Get a massage. Can Tyrians even get massages? <laughs> sort of. We get vibrations through the carapace with a hammer. Oh, uh, not for me. I'm fine, just people watching. That doesn't sound pleasant at all. Damn, Ryder, you just missed a good show. One of the alarms malfunctioned, and we thought it was an attack. It didn't take long to figure it out, but in that time, they managed to scramble at least half the station's defenses. Why are the alarms still malfunctioning? Probably a leftover issue from when the Scourge fried systems. It's not that bad. I once worked in a building with a fire alarm that would glitch every other week. You ever just think I miss home? Every time I do, I feel I guilty it. about it. It's like they spawn when I'm not looking. It never ends. Hey, Ryder. Of course, there's a bar. No dancers, though. Makes a change from Omega. And the Sistel one. That's your flag, everyone. That's Podromos. Hey, Liam. I thought I recognized that voice. Things are shaping up, Pathfinder. Resources flowing in, sleep is ready to head out. It's starting to feel like the initiative. Not quite up to the sales pitch, but getting there. Feels good, right? I feel it, Liam. Finally getting our start. There we go. Getting our shit together. Showing the new galaxy that we have it sorted. Mm. If I keep saying it, it's true, right? Mm. Ryder. Oh, another one. Damn it. This is supposed to be the chemistry lab. My chemistry lab. You all keep crawling out of the woodwork like space cockroaches. You say that, Dutch, but here you are, pouring people drinks. Uh, hi. I'm standing right here. They're guinea pigs, damn it. Chemists should have guinea pigs. Not have their labs taken over by people giving them things and... and being nice. Bad people giving you free things and helping you set up. So inconsiderate. Right? They keep bringing things. Tables and chairs and this bar and... Lights! Wait, you're making fun of me, aren't you? Don't let Dutch put you off. He's a sweetie, really. I'm not. <laughs> and the drinks are good. Damn right they are. Uh, I mean... <sighs> yeah. I'm a dirty squirrel. <laughs> what? Why is it good that? You're back. People happen when you work at a bar. <laughs> Got you there, Dutch. I'll have to get used to you too, I guess. <laughs> Fine. You can be a regular. What's your name? Ryder. I'm Dutch. That's Anan over there. Be careful. The snark is strong with that one. <sighs> snark is good. I can work with snark. <sighs> You're one of those. <laughs> Looks like you're outnumbered, Dutch. You'd think people would reconsider picking on the guy making the drinks, but no. <laughs> Speaking of, want to try this one? I'm going to call it the Tall Moose. What? That's the point. Don't piss off the person making the drinks. I got myself hammered. You again. Oh, I mean, hello. Welcome to my lab. Bar. Whatever. 
Oh, Dutch, look at you, getting all used to things. Things are fine. It's people I don't like. They talk back. Maybe they can't resist your charm. I hadn't thought of that. <laughs> Wait. You're messing with me, aren't you? I would never. Right. Here. Have a drink. Rotten scoundrel. Hey, now. The drink. Not you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Drink of the hour is a lucky leprechaun. Wanna give it a shot? How lucky are we talking here? I forget where the ingredients are from. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Excellent. I implore you. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. Wait, there's someone that you moved the other way to sleep. What the hell? Really? You should look really weird going down as well. What do you want? Hello, Pathfinder. A moment? What can I do for you, Doctor? I have a math problem. Some vital equations that only a mind like Sam's could solve. They concern strange transmission patterns in the Scourge. Perhaps random noise. Perhaps not. Sam likes new experiences. It'll be an opportunity to encounter math homework. Given the complexity and the security implications, I recommend transferring the equations directly into Sam node. I have them on an optical storage disk for you. I'll see if I have time. Thank you, Pathfinder. Please thank Sam as well. Jack. How many times have I told you this story? 343. Wait, what? You've been keeping count? <laughs> Rusha, that's not funny. Of course you'll come and see his granddaughter. Which one you use, Bogan? Cash reminds everyone all power grid adjustments must be approved yeah. beforehand. Pathfinder, I believe you found the culprit responsible for the power shortages. I don't can it. Alert Professor Herrick to come secure it. Okay, anything. I don't even see anything. Oh, there's something there. Oh, my God, let me talk to you. Ryder, can you believe this place? One space station slightly dented? You should have seen it a year ago. It was more than just dented. Anyway, thanks for bringing me on. Tan can't kick me off the station now, and it's been nice seeing my granddaughter again. The two of you seem close. It's been Kesha me against the galaxy the moment I got her. Well, maybe not as much now, but it sure was early on. Raj and Zara find Afghan. Zara Ford can swallow him whole for all I care. You sure look thoughtful. Just thinking about the first time Cash got her hands on a toolkit. Master engineer from the day she was born? Quads, no. She worked hard at it. Let's see, the first time, yeah, it was our power generator. She took it apart. <laughs> With the blood side. <laughs> Wouldn't that cause shorts or something? She liked the fireworks. You can imagine what it was like when she figured out that cracking open bigger things made even bigger sparks. <sighs> Cash, Spender is at it again. Did you tell him I was coming down to check on you? He still won't leave me alone. He's pretending to inspect my work. Right. Cycling airlocks 56B and 57B now. That worked. He's leaving. Thank you. Someone being harassed. Hey, Ryder. Good job on the outpost. Maybe Addison will lighten up. What do you mean? She's been pretty upset about not having an initiative outpost established yet. Understandable, if you ask me. 
I'm just glad she's got work to focus on now. Nothing more for now. Good luck out there. No, oh, I like those two. So, are you happy? No, it isn't what we wanted, but what choice do we have? How the hell should I know? Spender, you have a job. If you want to keep it, do it. God damn it. Yeah, she doesn't sound happier to me. You've shaken things up, Pathfinder. My department actually has colonial affairs to direct. And you have new tools to help grow the initiative. AVP, ready for spending. Sam said there was new functionality to discuss. It's how the initiative was designed to support the Pathfinder. You and your team are out there making Andromeda viable. That empowers all of us. Hit a threshold. A new cryo group can be brought out. Want more focus on research, like on Prodromos? That's your call. Brecca will introduce the interface and handle minutia. All you need to do is decide what life in Andromeda means. No pressure. Mm. Thanks. A reminder to all personnel over time. Pathfinder. Hello. Director Tan is expecting you. Last time I was here, this was a storage closet. Pathfinder Hall just needed a Pathfinder to open. We're still getting the commons area ready. Hydroponics is only at partial capacity. Not good enough. We don't have enough people. My workers need a break, Tan. I sympathize, but not until our survival is no longer at risk. Now please excuse me while I meet with our Pathfinder. Hey, Ryder. Addison told me about the outpost. You're the hero of the hour. Let's hold off on the celebration. We haven't found home yet. Oh, there's no need for modesty. Success affords leverage over those who doubted you. And you're my best friend. A patron. One who shares your vision of a prosperous future. I suppose we agree on that much. I knew that given a chance, your talents would emerge. You really... Deciphering the vault, alien terraforming. It's not how we imagined all this, but a good Pathfinder improvises. And a great one hangs it on the wall. <laughs> Yours are the first trophies to grace Pathfinder Hall. You're a symbol now, Ryder. A reason for people to believe. It wouldn't have been possible without my crew. They're a talented bunch. But you're their beacon. Careful. You'll end up adopting you, Ryder. <laughs> ah, my staff. Colleagues, you wouldn't be looking to cut us out, would you, Tan? I remind you, I am the director of the initiative. Acting director. This isn't the time for arguing over who gets to be king. Too much is at stake. We should be cooperating. That's what I've been saying since we arrived. Then I look forward to winning our Pathfinder support. I have concerns about your decision on Eos Rider. An outpost full of scientists won't do as much good if the Ket attack. But it will help support the Nexus. Improved research could help feed our people. And we could argue about it all day long, as we always do. The decision was made. Now we move on. What is your plan for moving on, Rider? We have a lead on the terraforming network. I need to take the Tempest deeper into the sector to investigate. If the other Golden Worlds are where they should be, this could get us closer to them. Careful. The Ked are scouring the cluster for remnant technology. You'll end up in a fight, for sure. You might also run into exiles. They didn't leave the Nexus on good terms. And we still need more outposts. They're important to expanding the station. Though with Ark still missing, this could be a chance for Ryder to search for them. Yes, I think that's best. You have my permission. Thank you, Director. I'll get on it. May you light the torch that finds the path. Pathfinder. Ugh. Right. <laughs> Ryder, this is Harry back on the Ark. Go ahead. We may have found a way to talk to your brother, sort of. Ooh. Drop by when you can. Hyperion Medbay. Will do. A reminder, you have AVP outstanding. Breck unlocked the AVP system. Just have to make the first spend to get started. Yeah. <gasps> 
Es ist wie Normandie. Oh, es ist Normandie. Apex Personnel, please check your duty roster for important updates. Oh, I miss you. Who's answering? Oh, Normandy. Feels like a part of the crew. <laughs> Whole mood of the Nexus has changed since Eos. You really can feel it. New outpost, a Pathfinder's help, people waking up. It's a fresh start. Can't relax yet. The initiative still has a lot of promises to keep. And that's on us. But it's damn good to know we're on the right track. Hydroponics reports oxygen production is nominal. Must be great to see all your hard work on display. Guess this is your place now. Everything we achieve will be seen here. Well, old man, we're getting there. Put in a good word for us. Tan likes to think he's keeping an eye on us. Works both ways. Superintendent this is how all those worlds all look from the Nexus. We forget how beautiful they are. Hi, Ryder. She tries to hide it, but I'm pretty sure she's still pissed at me. Let's be honest, I'd rather lead than be led. Annoying. Hi, Ryder. Any logistics updates are had a year to think about it. It's the Scourge, Director Tan. Its origin defies all known explanation. How? We've brought all that equipment along. And the Tempest's readings are helping, but we've just scratched the surface. The history of the Initiative cannot show that we were defeated by a space cloud. Some things are bigger than we are. I will not accept that excuse. This is science, and your merry band over there are scientists, aren't they? Figure it out. Goodbye, Director. Ryder, you're off to a promising start. I meant what I said. You are a symbol now of hope that things will get better. Though I worry about this terraforming network. What do we really know about it? It's like nothing we've ever seen. It's clear somebody had big plans for this cluster. But who? Not sure yet, but at least we're on the trail. Did you have some other business? Director, I checked out that murder. Nilkin didn't do it, but there's proof that he meant to. This is unfortunate. We're trying to give the people a sense of stability, leadership they think they can count on. And we're setting precedent for justice here in Andromeda. Now this, a convicted murderer who didn't commit the murder. I hear you. It sucks when things aren't black and white. Are they ever? Mm. <sighs> If we suppress the evidence and uphold the conviction, we're banishing a man for a crime he technically didn't commit. Mm -hmm. If we throw the conviction out, we're freeing a man who tried to take matters into his own hands, then covered it up. Your investigation complicated this. You should take responsibility for the outcome. Do we still exile him for murder? Oh, great. Oh, I don't know. This one's a hard one. Oh, I don't know what to do. He tries to do it, but technically he didn't. So... Ah... Oh. It can't even be counted as manslaughter, because he didn't touch him. Oh, this is hard. See, if he wounded him, I'd go, I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. If he didn't kill him, I'd still exile him straight away. But even though he tried to kill him, he didn't even touch him. Oh, I don't know what to do. This is so hard. So I'd like to exile him, but technically he didn't do anything. It was the cat. I think I might release him. And he needs to know. If he actually does do something, that's it. Exile. It was crazy down there. Life and death. But his shot didn't kill Reynolds. We have to let him go. You're a bottom line type of person. I hope we don't regret it. All right, so be it. He will do community service for his role in the chaos, but he's a free man. 
Well, at least we'll have the sordid business behind us. Mm. I can't believe it. You're free. Oh, Pathfinder, we have you to thank. Yes. I'm glad you did the right thing, Ryder. You'd better live a clean life, Nilkin. Or else... What? What does she mean by that, love? I'll tell you later. Let's just get home. Apex personnel, please check your duty roster for important updates. Bastard. Alright, so I'm leaving it there.